This is waste, metallic swarf from machining processes. And in this case, it's very expensive titanium waste that comes from the production of incredibly finely engineered parts for the aircraft and aerospace industry. A six machine line like this can fill 50 of these every week. Just imagine how much waste like this is being produced in machining facilities like this all around the world. It makes you think, maybe there's a better way of doing things. And that's why we're here. This is GKN Aerospace, the technology partner for the global aerospace industry. At facilities like this and all around the world, GKN Aerospace is making vital parts and assemblies for the latest civil and military aircraft, like this wing spar for an Airbus A380, to landing gear retraction jack fittings, entire wing structures, even complete engine systems. So when GKN Aerospace thinks about doing things better, there are no half measures. And sometimes it takes a truly disruptive technology to transform an industry. A technology like additive manufacturing. GKN Aerospace has established global centres of excellence like this to push the boundaries of this amazing technology to find out what's possible, what's next. Changing an industry doesn't happen overnight. It takes commitment, investment and collaboration with academics, with government and research organisations, with strategic suppliers and with customers. So, what's driving this change? Well, there are the internal drivers of production efficiencies, cost reductions and improved time to market. And on the other side, there are the customer-led drivers. Lighter, stronger, better performing, more efficient. Additive manufacturing will deliver these benefits. And less material means less energy, less waste, fewer transport journeys and a reduced carbon footprint. It's the start of a revolution in the way that parts like these are manufactured, the way they're designed and the materials that they're made from. It gives designers complete freedom to entirely rethink how a part should perform without the constraints of traditional manufacturing. That brings huge benefits. Remember that machining waste? Well, traditionally, this part starts life as a block of titanium that weighs about five kilograms. To get it to this results in four kilograms of waste and an immense amount of machining. Now, with additive manufacturing, we can start with just one kilogram of titanium powder and end up with a lighter, higher performance part and cutting waste by more than 95%. But that is only part of the story. The big benefits come throughout the value chain. Design to tooling time is slashed. Complex shapes can be achieved easily. Casting and machining processes are redundant. Even transport costs are cut right down. For this one item, conventional production could take up to 95 weeks Additive manufacturing can cut that down to 12 and give a lighter, higher performing product at the end. So where does this technology lead us in the next 10 or 20 years? Well, for one thing, the supply chain will look very different. Materials, engineering and creation will be at the heart of production. Product performance will be designed into the base material and combined within the same deposition cycle. This takes us into areas of manufacturing where design and function become the key drivers. Into biomimetics, where the freedom of manufacturing will enable us to mimic the efficiency of the building blocks of biological structures, creating forms that are grown to provide the strength and performance properties that designers imagine from the minimum of material content. 
Here at Filton and in the other global centres of excellence that GK and Aerospace has committed to, they're taking the latest concepts in additive manufacturing and transforming them into viable working processes that deliver tangible benefits to the business and to its customers. GKN Aerospace is truly shaping the future.